Uh, kind of hope you can hear me. Who cares if you can't, though? Right? I can always do the recording later. Anyways, um, last time you saw me was, well, literally half a second ago. But last time I saw this world was actually, um, days ago, I think. Haven't really had much time ever since I got off. Ooh, actually, could this be a better path than that? Uh, I could put a little fishing area down there. So, it's been a few days for me. Haven't had much time to actually do any video working recently, but you know, it happens, and now I'm back. So, I'm just, you know, gonna finish up this episode real quick. Don't exactly remember what I was doing last time, but I guess I do remember I wanted a parrot, but that's, that's all I remember. So, speaks, oh, look at that house shape, I guess. I don't really know. It doesn't look very good, but it's fine. So, hmm, I think I can get parrots with normal seeds, but I kind of want a farm. Where would I put a farm? Up here. Wouldn't be in the way of my house. I don't really want anything in the way of my house. It'd be kind of annoying. Okay, let's see what we can do. Maybe I could have like a pathway going up here. Right here would be like my little farming area. I think that would kind of work. So, I'm not sure. I don't think I'll cut this part out because I'm talking right now and it would be really difficult to find. Well, not really difficult, but you know, it'd be a bit troubling to find out where I left off. So, might as well just make you guys watch. Well, Literally, no one's going to watch this video, but if anyone does watch this video, I'm sorry. You can skip ahead. I, well, actually, since I'll probably watch the whole video when I'm editing, I'll see if I can put in, like, a timestamp to when I won't be digging dirt, right? And then you guys don't have to listen to me saying any of this. And you're welcome, because I'm a genius, and I just came up with that, even though it's already a thing. So, this is a big enough area for farmland. Better be, because this is where I'm putting the farm, and there's no change in that anymore. God. These biomes are so beautiful. I'm going to have to go over there at some point. I like the, the material. Looks nice. Oh, my inventory is so unorganized. Okay, sh shovel. I'm not making any extra tool mistakes anymore. I'm trying my hardest not to do that. I've been playing. I've played some Minecraft since last time. Not on the on the the world, but I played some Minecraft. I actually tried the April Fools update, which was um. More fun than I expected, actually. Um, I expected it to kind of be a bit dull, boring, empty, but it was like it was honestly pretty good. Um, because I I've seen a lot of videos about it. Other people have made videos on that, and I feel like it's already too late to make a video on something that's been gone for so long. Everyone's already played it, but me. But um, I've seen so many videos on it that I kind of thought it would be boring to play since I've seen other people play it, but no, it's actually, it was actually a really fun experience, I liked it, they did a really good job with the ones this year, um, I'll have to go back and check out the other ones, because I never actually played an April Fool's update before that, um, well, I didn't really know they existed until quite recently, actually, they were, um, I wasn't really big on the Minecraft community, like, I didn't look into any YouTubers and stuff until more recently in my life, so I don't 
I never really knew much about what was going on with the game, and I just had to guess, which I'm trying to start doing now, because I realize it actually makes the game a bit more fun when I don't know exactly what's happening all the time, which kind of makes sense. It's an element of supplies that you get when you first start playing the game, and I kind of want to bring that back, you know? So, I'm almost done clearing this out. I think I need a hoe, though. No, I know I need a hoe, like, 100%. A bucket of water. It should be simple enough to get. What am I going to do? I think I can make the hoe right now, so I'm going to go for that. I don't think I have iron yet, so the bucket might be a bit difficult. More difficult. But it's always, it's always achievable. Okay, where do I put the mine? I guess first I should check if I can already have some iron. Nope, I don't even have a chest room yet. Do I have? I don't have any chests. I don't really want to put them there since it's a, it's a three by three, so that won't fit very well. But for personal chests, I guess it works. Put it away from the window. So I'm just going to store all my stuff in there for a second. We'll move all of this later because it is not a very good place to have it. But it'll be fine for now. So much dirt. What are we going to do with that bit of terraforming at some point, hopefully? I do like to terraform. It's, it's quite fun, actually. But it's um time-consuming and a bit boring at the start. You gotta, you gotta let, let the game let you get used to it for a bit, the patience, and then smooth sailing from there. Okay, and then a bit of dirt, just in case I need to go. And it's already nighttime. Of course it's nighttime. Why wouldn't it be? Don't think I'll need that many yet, but need to be more prepared than less. And to sleep I go. I think. Should I just go in this cave? I can light it up quickly. It will be fine. I'm being very quiet right now, aren't I? I'm either very quiet or very loud, which is a problem in both ways. Like, they're all... Oh, God. Nope, nope, not... Not doing that. Sorry, can you get... Tiny bit closer. We're good. We're good. Not dying to a baby zombie. Please die. Oh, thank the gods. That was... More stressful than it should be. My bed's like three feet away. Whatever. Um, I think that was one of the first baby zombies I've actually killed on Java. I struggle with those a lot. Well, not the first one, but first one on this uh, account so far. So far, there shall be thousands more baby zombies to come. Oh, well, hopefully not, actually. I think we can vote a mob out for the mob vote. Like, honestly, baby zombies might be worse than the Phantom, in my opinion. It's really bad. I just need them to be a bit slower in their hitboxes. No, not slower. Their speed is what makes them scary. They need the speed. But the hitboxes 
are way too slow, which makes it really difficult to fight them. Which I guess is the whole point, which makes sense. They need, like, a difficult mob to fight, and I guess they don't, they don't really have that much health to do that. So that's not a problem. It's just, it's difficult to hit them, because when you're, you're freaked out, you're in a cave, you just heard a cave boom, right? And then you hear the zombie noise, and you're like, oh no. This is going to be bad, and it is going to be bad. And then you see the fastest little creature ever running at you. You need to be able to hit it, because you're going to be panicked. So you got to make the hitbox a bit bigger, right? But I guess that's just a skill issue. In this little case scenario. Oh, there's more coal. Okay. I think six is enough, right? I mean, for now. We'll run out quick because we plan on doing a lot of stuff, right? But for now, this will be a good amount of iron. I say it's a good amount, but I'm still exploring. I don't think I'll stop exploring until I consciously tell myself to. This is your conscious. Okay. Just at least... Sir? Gonna walk over this way. Okay, there we go. That's all I need. If I die now, I don't think I'll find my stuff. Thankfully, I barely have anything. Besides every piece of iron I've ever gotten. In this world. No. Oh, that was insane. Sir. I'm, like, deathly afraid of creepers. I hate those things. I'm not deathly afraid. There's things I'm more afraid of than creepers. Not really in Minecraft, though. I feel like those come pretty high up. Besides the sound endermen make when they're mad. After they die. And it just rings in your ears for a few minutes. Really, really, um... Makes it set in. They're angry, and they're, they're coming for you. You'll never be free. I really... I like all the towns in the game. It really They really add to the atmosphere of... Well, like, the seriousness of it all. You're about to die. Everything's loud. Everything's scary. The sounds aren't necessarily urgent, but they're... They're misplaced, I guess, which makes it feel urgent, unusual, which isn't a good thing. So, we just, it just doesn't seem right, which I think is what makes it best, honestly. Okay. There goes that. So, we have... All of that ready. I'll just put the pickaxes back in there. Put those away. Still need the... Still, still need the that. The that, the that. Might as well just 
Take all the tools, right? Is that the sound of that cooking? I never realized that had a sound. That's actually really cool. Yay! Instantly into a bucket. Zero second thoughts. I'm so lucky today. Today's today's going great, honestly. I'm not sure what else I could wish for in a Minecraft world, especially this early on. Actual perfection. Yeah, I'm not sure if I were to play music. Is there a way for me to play the music and then the music not be heard by everyone watching the video, but I can still hear it? Like, I think there would be a way to do that. I think I can mute certain tabs, but I, uh, I'm just really not sure about it because I do like listening to music when I play games, but I'm not sure if it would uh, distract me from talking. Which I never realized that was a problem for YouTubers. Well, obviously it's not a problem for like the bigger ones anymore. But I always kind of just thought they were natural talkers, which I don't think anyone is anymore. It's not a it's not a thing we're we're born with. You kinda have to raise it into you. I'm not saying I'm not saying that people can't be good at speaking right after they're born. I'm just saying it's a bit No one's perfect right after they're born, which is, which is a good thing. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. And then. One, two, three, four. A CD place. What would happen if I were to get uh what if I were to use fortune on seeds like cuz there's no specific seed tool that you this is the grass breaking tool that you need besides like shears but that wouldn't give you two two grasses it would give you one grass it would give you the grass plant, not the seeds, so that doesn't really count. So is there a way to use fortune, the enchantment on seeds? I feel like that'd be really helpful for farming, or starting out farming. Like, if you were trying to, if you didn't have a farm early game, which I always like to have my farms early game, because when you're looking for a netherite, shh. Um, early and late game, you can use beds, which aren't as good of an explosion as TNT, but it provides a, a relatively large explosion that you can block out, like I think every other explosion, you can block it out with a block at your feet, so then it's not overly dangerous to yourself and then it does like every few explosions you'll get some netherite which i think is pretty good i mean i'm not a professional netherite harvester but i do think that any netherite any amount of netherite is um is a good amount of netherite because, well, I still remember times when I didn't know how to find diamonds in general, like just rare ores. And honestly, it's so much better now that I do know how to find those things. Because, like, I don't know, it's, it's a bit, bit boring when you get to a point where you just can't grow 
anymore. So now I know how to how to do all the things. Why didn't I just come here originally? There's so many seeds. So many so much grass. I don't think you can hear the music for some reason. Last time, last time I did the video and I was listening to it. Well, that's inconvenient. When I was listening to it in the editing, I realized that I couldn't hear any music in the background, which I guess is a good thing because the music is very loud and my voice is kind of quiet sometimes so don't really want to be overpowered by music but you know the music's nice it's nostalgic just makes the game a lot funner more fun uh to in my opinion watch and to play if you if you have some background music that's one of the negatives to listening to your own music when you're playing the game because it's uh it really takes away from the experience of Minecraft because it's just this mystical open world where you can do whatever you want or like close to whatever you want. And to add to this mystical world, they decided to add sounds and music and beautiful chorus, you know. And then you know, listen to the your own music and it kind of it adds a message it can add messages in the game that aren't exactly meant to be there which is fine i guess but not intended for how the game was meant to be played and i guess there's there's no real way minecraft was meant to be played that's the beauty of it it's a it's a open world game where you can just do whatever you want Almost infinite. But, yeah, that's just how I feel. Oh. That's fun. That would be really fun trying to get all of the... All, all of the everything. Just ev everything that has varieties to get all of them. Like, that's a really good power move. Oh, that actually makes sense. So if I were to get, like, every type of parrot and every type of cat, and I feed you cocoa beans. Like, I feed you normal seeds. I don't want to feed you normal seeds, so. Hello! What is, what is your name? I can make it much better, did it? What, what is your name? Patrick. Hello, Patrick. Welcome to the family. Follow me, we're coming home. Come on, come along, Patrick. We must head home now. Patrick? Yep, okay. <gasps> the sand. I love the sand. Oh god, I'm lost. Well. This is quite the inconvenience, isn't it? Patrick? Okay. You know, Patrick, he's always behind. Poor little Patty. I actually knew a guy named Patrick. He was nice. Forgot about him for a while. Actually surprised me. He just came up to me one day and was like, hey, um, you remember me? And I was like, no, weirdly enough, I don't. And he was like, oh, well, that's fine. I'm Patrick, and you knew me from school at some point, and we were actually quite good friends. I was very surprised by that, because I know I'm still friends with most of the people I was friends in, in school, in elementary, because... Well, elementary was really the, the socializing years besides kindergarten. So, 
Oh, parrots can teleport. Patty, 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 Patty baby, Patty, can you just sit down for a second, please? Thank you, darling. Oh, to the door we go. To the door, Patty, to the door. You know, when I first saw the parrot, a few different names went through my mind. Um, one of them was like the classic parrot name, which I'm not sure what it was. I forget, but I think it was like Perry. Not that Perry is the platypus, not not a woodpecker. It's a parrot, and then it was Patricia. But then I realized Patricia is kind of like a Karen name, you know. Which, which we don't want. We don't want our bird to be a Karen. So, his full name was Patty Whistler. Pat, Patty Whistlebird. Whistletongue. Patty Whistleton. Patty Whistleton. See? There you go, Patty. You have a full backstory now. You were born somewhere in, like, I don't know, Europe, where they have British accents. No. Ireland. Scotland. Scotland, I think it's Ireland. You're born in Ireland. You're not an alcoholic, Patty. Don't worry. Okay. Now that Patty's safe and at home, we gotta plant the rest of the seeds before nightfall. Well, when night falls come when when night when nightfall comes, the danger follows. see how close was I so close yet so far okay what are we gonna double layer oh we're so close once we get that I can bring over some sheep which I'm not sure I think sheep spawn in the jungle actually very commonly I've seen a few sheep and pigs and cows in the jungle. Their spawn rates are probably lowered because of like the other jungle things, but they are quite common. Um, I actually lived in the jungle once, not in real life, but in Minecraft. What's that? That's a cow. That's what a cow sounds like. Hello? Bah. Sorry, my friend. We're on a tight schedule. Don't have time for tea. You know what? Tell the others. Spread the word. This is my environment now. I'm sorry. I was very harsh. Have some sugar cane. God, I haven't had sugar cane in so long. The juice is good. Look at our quaint little cottage. Close oh, a little cottage sitting in the forest. Chilling just like it should. In the nook and cranny of the jungle. Where we live and where we will live. Until I get bored of the jungle and then we'll go somewhere else. Maybe the Mesa. Then we'll move to a desert. I do like deserts. Deserts are interesting. <gasps> I want a camel. Oh, and every type of villager. We'd have to get every type of villager to go along with the everything. With the everything. The everything. A little bit of everything. All of the time. There's a time and place for that song, and the time and place is not here and not now. But apathy is a tragedy important. I'd rather not get sued for copyright infringement. My voice is not good enough to get sued for copyright infringement. I am slightly concerned that one of these will grow in the other's way. Oh no, this guy has the choice to grow wherever he wants. Grow away, my friend. Grow away. Okay, that might be it for today. 
short little, well, actually not very short, because this will be combined with the other episode I filmed. You know what? Me and Patty must get going. Bye, everybody. Uh, see you next time, I guess.